Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It's episode 93, and we're continuing our playthrough of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2, The Sith Lords. We've been making our way through the Merchant Quarter, Merchant Quarter, and uh, we seem to have run across a few friends. Well, clones of friends, but I probably should have subbed him into the group now. Sorry, now that I think about it, but, uh, oh well. We, uh, we can't repair them and fix that, so. <laughs> that, that would be kind of nice if we could fix them up and then beat them down again. Hey, one of those security terminals that somebody was kind of antsy about me getting to. Hmm. If only somebody had a uh, high computer use skill. Access denied. Oh. I guess I don't have a high enough computer use skill. I, I deeply suspect that that's one of those terminals that it doesn't matter how high your skill is. What you need to roll is five points higher. Than whatever it is you just got. Okay. There must come a time when the queen bows to the will of the people. The Republic has brought nothing but war and death. In our 50 years of flying their colors, we have had more war than the past millennia. Because that war was coming. His effort to make the Mandalorians were not going to leave we you alone. This is the way. They need our resources, our world, and our blood. For all that we have given, now we get nothing. The Republic is weak and falling apart. Its Jedi, whose fallen oh, well, brethren yeah. have brought such misery to us, have disbanded. Let's be the first world to take our future into our hands. <laughs> Are you with me? This isn't going to go as you think. Uh, who, me? Not my concern. Surely the Republic does something in return for you. The Queen should listen to the will of her people. Ah, let's stir things up. Surely the Republic does something in return for you. No, they take from us. Mm -hmm. They are like Minox, sucking energy and resources from so many worlds. Like people they spending time for their shouting in the their public excesses. square instead of doing something That's useful. Enough, Ponlar. If you keep this up, you're going to spend time in detention. You're coming awfully close to treason. You can't silence me forever, soldier. But I'll keep my peace. For hmm. now. I bet. I can't believe the Republic assaulted our space forces. Yeah, Instead that didn't session, happen. We should declare war. General Vatler's royalty too. I know a lot of people that wish he was king. Uh-huh. These are dangerous times. People like Ponlar aren't making it any easier. I didn't know he was on Twitter. Oh, wait. If I speak more right now, the soldiers will arrest me. Perhaps later. <laughs> yeah. No. I think Vaclo is using Republic spies as an excuse to intimidate anybody that, that would oppose him. Alright, what else we got? Oh. I heard the Paragas mining facility. Just another. I'm quite busy right now. Perhaps later we could talk. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, that's right. She's the one for the dark side people. I can't believe that the Republic assaulted our space force. You yeah, I can't believe that the news is reporting that either. Crowds and crowds and... But General Vaclu would cut himself off from the many planets of the Republic. This is foolish. In solitude, no civilization prospers. You don't understand the people of Andor. They are proud and have fought many adversities to get where they are. Mostly by themselves, too. And with themselves, apparently. Uh, they give much of the Republic and see little in return. General Vaclu believes independence would be in Isis. Yeah. But Republic fight battles to free Andoran from Mandalorian warriors. Should be thankful. Yeah, exactly. Queen Telly is young but looks after her people. Um, no, the Mandalorians would have been here. Let's be honest. Uh, let, let, let's stop this. Oh, the Mandalorians would have left us alone if only it wasn't for the Republic. Have you seen the Mandalorians? Have you been following their philosophy? The, uh, I, <laughs> yeah, no, that, 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 this wasn't going to happen the way you think it was. Did he just run up and stab me in the back with an axe? Dude. Uh, 
Uh, so what do you think of Queen Talia? Talia works with the Republic. She rules peaceably and is popular with her people. Okay. Her intentions are good, I admit, but those close to power see the mistakes she makes. Nobles, high-ranking military, they all support General Vaklu. does not have the experience of governing or the support of rich and powerful people. Okay, I don't know much about General Vaklu. <laughs> Vaklu lies. He twists words and tries to take the take heart of people away from their rightful queen. Uh, he's a war, or he's a war hero, leader of the resistance during the Mandalorian Wars, a man of vision and experience. He may not tell all the truth, but he works for the best interest of the people. Yeah, he would start war to oust the good queen. Uh, that is a good question. Who do you trust more? I don't trust Vaklu. He lies to people, has been caught in them before. Tally has been honorable. The question is unfair. Sometimes leaders know things the rest of us can't know. It's not an excuse for lying, though. I may not trust anything, everything he says, or his people, but he's also a man of honor. He never breaks a promise. <laughs> but if you can't trust the leader's words, then how can you trust their motives? Yeah. Hello, <laughs> Hello moral quandary. Uh, trusting your leaders is crucial. I'd rather support Queen Talia. Maclu sounds capable and has ambition. Uh, the queen is Andoran's rightful ruler. Deposing her would be treason. <laughs> the Republic has taken a advantage of Andoran. A little revolution now and again can be a good thing. I'll lend support to whomever serves my interest better. Now, I do want to support the queen. The question is, is it a rightful ruler or trust? I'm going to go with the trust thing, because I, I don't like leaning on the whole, well, you know, they in charge. Hmm. I kind of figured you would agree with me from the beginning of this. Hey, uh, are, are there drinks involved in this discussion at the cantina? What is the Star Wars equivalent of Dwarven Whiskey? Surely there's got to be a, a, a something that you can order. All right, those are all people yada yada -ing. That's another empty... Empty nothing. Uh, and this is... I probably can't go here. That looks like a very can't go here, but... Sky Why not? Ramp is restricted to military personnel. Uh, only. Okay. Stay clear of here, off worlder. What's the sky ramp? The sky ramp leads to the battlements, and this particular ramp leads straight to the palace okay. itself. No civilians are allowed past this point. I mean <laughs> let me pass. I need to reach the palace. Um Let me try a persuade. I'm no. the one in charge here, Offworlder. Okay, if okay, you're okay. You're in charge, you're in charge. Have the entire Isis garrison on you in seconds. Um. There's no chance of that, Offworlder. The palace is locked down tight, and only <laughs> authorized personnel are allowed in. No, I'm not going to try the Force Persuade. Let's just go with the who are you. I am Captain Bastuco. I have served loyally in the Onderon military for 20 years. 20 years would mean you were here during the Mandalorian War. Oh, curious you're bringing right. that one up. I was a soldier when the Mandalorians took our world, and I fought in the Resistance. When we drove them from Onderon, I served on the Wall for 10 years after. You mean after the Jedi drove the Mandalorians from Onderon? The Mandalorians never gave ground to any Onderon soldier. Dude, you're not Sister helping. Duke you're not helping. Considered treason. Onderon was responsible for much of the fighting during the last days of the war. Without General Vaklu, the Republic would have fallen. Um, he seems to have a very elevated opinion of his efforts in the war. Uh, could you tell me about the wall? 
The wall is the I mean, other than it's a great song and, and a great album. Hundreds of years, we kept the city free of beasts and beast rider scum. <laughs> the greatest honor for an officer is to serve on the wall. Many aspire to the post, but few are worthy of it. So you're just another officer in the wall. <laughs> so why aren't you on the wall anymore? I was requested to guard oh. the sky rack okay. in a merchant quarter. You don't sound too pleased. My personal feelings on the matter are irrelevant. I received an order and I carried it out. Yes, sir. Sir, yes, sir. So what do you think of the general? General Vaclav I think was I already know. Superior officer and I respect the chain of command. He kept the, the chain he uses to let you know who's in command. Destroying our world. All right. Uh, I guess I'll be going then. I told you before, Offworlder, the sky ramp is restricted to military personnel only. Now move along. All right. All right, all right, all right. Let's, uh, let's head into the Western Square then. So far, so good. Fairly straightforward. <laughs> we don't get too many shuttles, especially shuttles without passengers. Um, y'all are standing there looking awfully menacing. A good friend works at the starport notices. It raised some questions. Questions I've answered. So you are an on junior. Last of a dying breed, they say. Too difficult to fight alone, they say. So I meet some of my new employees. <laughs> The bounty on your head will make me and my men extremely wealthy. This is my lucky day. No good, sir. It is not your lucky day. All right. Let's, uh, you know what? Let's do the wave. Let's get a shield going. Let's get some extra attacks in. And let's get a Valor. And I'll let these guys do their thing. Um, can I get you? Yeah, this is probably going to get into melee quick. Can you promise me that you're going to do that? All right. Let's, uh, let's get the show on the road. Did you actually do what I told you to? <laughs> yeah, cut him down. Who's who's tossing grenades? Is it you, Mando? Are you tossing grenades? That's... That's not helping. That reminds Something me. You need. Oh, no. You're set to aggressive. Okay. Go ranged? Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Alright, looks like we have, uh... New equipment to inventory. <laughs> A computer spike, generously donated. Some accuracy gloves, also generously donated. What else we got over here? Anything? We've got a nice little spot to get murdered in. I mean, it didn't work out for them, but... In theory. Alright, nothing there. And what we got in these remains? A tranquilizer dart. Because it did him so much good. <sighs> okay. Anything here? Nope. Uh, hey, did, any did anybody notice that there have been tons of soldiers patrolling this place, hither and yon? Like, we can't turn a corner without a soldier popping out from somewhere. And then this band of merry men 
decides to, you know, try to rob my hood. Where's the soldiers? Concerned citizens would like to know. Uh, when you have thug in your name. A lot of credits to be made around here lately. If you have yeah. the right skills. And if you have a certain set of skills, and you're not afraid to use them. Pile of trash. There are some remains of droid here. I thought there was something else to look at over here. I mean, other than the blood spot. Oh, okay. We can't do anything about that until we've learned about the murder. Beasts are acting up again. Yeah, I noticed that. Some of those alien thugs had a go at you, right? <laughs> I, um, I don't want to cross you. <laughs> Smart man. Go back to your ship off, Wilder. We don't need your kind and eyes. Well, show me to my ship then. See how that goes for you. All right. Have any work that needs to be done? Nope. Uh, what do you we have writer. here? Last thing we need is more competition. Nope. This is our part of the merchant quarter. Watch your step. Yeah. Pickings are scarce these days. Most people avoid the streets now. Yeah, I can't imagine why. Not like thugs don't jump out of a corner to mug you for no good reason. I mean, other than the bounty on your head. I, I would have thought I was attracting a better quality of a uh, bounty hunter by now. I am one B A D, an automated droid vendor. I have oh. a stock of a variety of quality droid components, no refunds, and no haggling. Do you have any interest in my goods? Uh. <laughs> Can I rewire you to be a little more helpful? Warning: Any attempt to interfere with one B A D's primary function will result in violence. Please back away from this unit's access panel. Oh. Uh, what about somebody Let's with go. an actual repair skill? I am 1B AD, an automated droid. Reinitializing complete. Greetings. Do you have any interest in my goods? There we go. Please give me components for free. Who do you work for? 1B AD was built and programmed by Tolos the Trader. 1BAD hmm. was built to buy droid components for below base cost value and sell components based on most favorable market conditions. Do you have any interest in my goods? You can give me against my primary behavior programming. All items must be sold based on the most favorable market conditions. Okay. 1BAD cannot haggle. This is also a part of my primary behavior matrix. <laughs> Request access to market conditions. Change all. Multiply by zero. Market conditions all set to zero. All prices now set to base cost value. Do you have any interest in my goods? Let me see what you got for sale. <laughs> wow. Okay. So that just happened. All right. Don't need the repair kits because I can make them, and they're they're not. I haven't been using that many of them anyway. The computer spikes I could probably use. I mean, I can technically make them. But, yeah, the spikes and parts, I'm always running short on. Uh, the security tunnelers, I've got a bunch of, but I never seem to actually need them. The, the open lock skill has been high enough that I really haven't needed a, a boost. Um... If you didn't pick up the HK Control Cluster earlier, or you did these in a different order, this is one of the places where you can get an HK Control cust uh, Cluster to rebuild HK-47. And um, I'm tempted to buy it just for the parts you can break it down for. But I'm not sure that's worth... Uh, well, I mean, it is only 250 credits now. Same, And for the spikes and 
parts they, they are cheaper now um yeah I'm not I'm not seeing any armor that uh really tickles my fancy except maybe this fighting upgrade that's a plus three to attack and an extra plus two to defense oh oh never mind that's most of my money never mind okay um I mean I like some of these options I really do but the stuff that would help me that would really help me just uh I don't have the money for of course I'd do things like buy the HK control cluster for parts no um same with the parts and no nah I'm gonna skip it all I might come back later, but all right. Heard of any good finds? N no, but I'm really interested in that 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 little bit of uh, blood splatter there. This is Dagon Gent's place. Oh. He's not the best doctor you'll ever meet, but he's well connected in this city. Doesn't look like he's here right now, though. You looking for Dagon? You're not gonna find him here. So where is he? The soldier captain was murdered at the cantina real good. They got oh. some suspects at the tower. From what I hear, Dagon Gent's oh. one of them. Okay. Could Dagon have done this? He's certainly capable of it. Oh. And probably stupid enough <laughs> to get caught. But we need him. Suspicion of murder or not. Okay. Do you think he did like it? I would know. Isis is a crazy place right now. That's fair. So what tower? It's the turret tower on the other side of the market. Uh -oh. Captain Rankin is the, the one that we can't get to. Thank you. If you talk to him, tell him I got his 20 credits. <laughs> okay. Hmm. So does the good doctor have any equipment that I should probably grab and bring to him? I promise I'll bring it to him. Yeah, that might come in handy. That might also come in handy. That'll come in handy. Alright, that's the lab station, so that's for making stem packs and grenades and stuff. Alright, um... I thought I saw that... The, the... There's something to interact with circle in a couple other spots, but, uh... Alright, I guess I was wrong. Okay. So there's the good doctor. Our informant has, uh, walked away. We should probably go back and check it's that drawer in a minute. To live on. Hard to keep the beasts in line nowadays. Alright. Uh, I'm not gonna go up to there yet because I don't know what that's going to do for me here so oh another group seriously seriously well come on then Let, let's get this over with y you guys want to shot up my bounty too ah, I thought it was you Captain Evan Hawk is it not Imagine what soldiers would do to you if they knew you're wanting their streets. You're a wanted criminal now. The wanted? Dead or alive. No. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and what if I am? How do you know me? If you're threatening me, prepare to die. Hello. My name is Anon Jr. Prepare to die. So what if I am? <laughs> the exchange is quite a bounty on you. Your head's worth many credits as long as it's recognizable. I'd take you alive, but I doubt I could keep a Jedi from escaping. Dead will have to do. Yeah. About that. Let's, uh... Let's take your, your boys back here first. Let's do that. Let's get the extra attacking around. Let's get the Valor up. 
And then, uh, and then we get a flurry. Oh, the Mandalorian doesn't have a, a melee weapon. Shoot. Uh, I gotta fix that. Let's get that queued up. Then we'll do another wave. And then we'll start flurrying. Alright, let's get this guy. Jump in with the wave. Uh oh. No, 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 no. Well, we got everybody nearby. We need to do a heal. A second heal. Then jump in with the wave. Somebody's about to die again. Some better armor or something. All right, so that's our second time getting assaulted on the same corner. All right, I'll take that. What is that? Let's top off everybody's health real quick. Alright. So, it's going to remind me again about the Starport Visa, but I don't think I've found one yet. We got the HK factory, and now we gotta, we definitely got to do something about the Doctor's Alibi. Um, I wish I knew why... Almost go it over there was dying so quick. I might need to grab a different minion. Accurate. Ooh! Five physical day. Oh, hey, those were the uh, accuracy gloves that I wanted to buy, but were too expensive. Hmm. Interesting how you get those. Ooh. Stealth and dexterity. All right, that's good to know. You know what? I love you, man, but uh. But your skills have come in handy. I just need somebody that's going to survive combat. All right, let's do this. Let's take you out. I can't add him because he's over at the Ebon Hawk. Um, you've got skills. Let's bring our droid along. Ooh, and we'll level them up soon, too. First, let's uh, finish making sure that we're not letting any uh, donations go uncollected. Is that everything? That appears to be everything. Oh, no, not quite. Oh, <laughs> oh this, is how, this is how you acquire an extra Starport Visa. I uh, now have the Bounty Hunter Starport Visa. Because, well, I mean, he doesn't need it anymore. And 400 bucks. And some armor that's going to make some lovely parts a little bit later. Alright, so let's do that. What else we got? A Strength Enhancer. That could be good. I mean, it wasn't good for him, but it works for me. Another 280 bucks. And what do we got here? Another 67 bucks. All right, money is becoming a little less of a problem. What's in the garbage pile? No, let's examine the droid now. There are some remains of a droid here. Trash pile. Okay. That was less helpful than I expected it to be. And we're about a half hour in, so let's do this. Let's go ahead and save the game. And, um, 
If you're watching on the live stream, don't go anywhere. We're not done yet, but I do need to insert a cut for the YouTube episodes. Well, that was fun. Unless I just died. Then it was a little less than fun. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you're having fun. And if you want to watch live, you can follow along on Twitch. I live stream the recording of the next six episodes at least once a week. I might even throw in some bonus content here and there if time allows. And you'll find the link in the description below. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when new episodes go up live stream archives from some of my other stuff and various and sundry other videos because i do more than just this and if you want to get notifications don't forget to hit the bell and if you really truly enjoyed it don't forget to give it a thumbs up and all that good fun stuff if you have any questions queries quips quotes comments complaints or other whatnot don't forget to leave those in the comments down below lastly if you're enjoying the show, if you're getting some value out of it, then consider giving a little value back. Go to live.anonjunior.com. It'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, however you want to think about it. And there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So if you're getting value out of the show and you would like to give a little value back, even if it's just enough for a cheap cup of coffee, then uh, consider going, giving a little bit especially if it tickled the nostalgia or opened your eyes to a new game that you might play. And uh, with all that said and done, we're, uh, we're going to cut out, have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.